Hope was started as a home for street kids. We started rescuing kids on the Thai side of the border, and uh, but some of them were still on the Burma side, and we knew we couldn't get them over to the Thai side or it would be like trafficking, so we said we have to do something on the Burma side. Around that time, I was looking over, and um, Myanmar was closed. We couldn't really get in, and we couldn't do anything. But I was praying. I was walking up and down our border and around the Friendship Bridge, and I was praying, and the Lord gave me the scripture, and he said, I will open the double doors before you, and I will give you treasures in darkness. And I knew that those treasures in darkness were the street kids and the begging kids and the kids that had just been thrown away and, and the laboring kids, the slave labor kids. And so from that, around that time, God opened the door, and we started rescuing the street kids on the Burma side. We opened up a feeding center, and we started feeding them, and then we started negotiating with their parents and the different owners to let them go to school. Seventeen street children used to be on the streets, barefoot, begging. They'd have to make about 70 baht a day, which is $2.10. If they wouldn't bring that home, they'd get beaten. Before you would ask them, what do they want to be when they grow up? And none of them would know. And they never had that chance to even dream or think about what they want to be. Now they have a future full of hope, just full of expectation. They're getting an education, and they're not destined to be beggars, traffic, just street children. That's why we named this home House of Hope. House of hope for these street children, house of hope for their future, house of hope for their lives.